Oh my god. That is ugly. I knew that was gonna happen. Hello friends, my name is Brent Nate and I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Awesome Knots. Today, we've got a match with Smiles, the crocodile. Flamethrowing crocodile. Um, <clears throat> as I said, when I did him in the beta, I do think that he's going to be nerfed quite shortly. Um, but for now, he's still good. He's still good to rock and roll. Even after a nerf, I think he's going to be fucking amazing. They have a Smiles, a Sentry, and I think a Leon. So <laughs> we snatch each other up in the trap right off the bat. Which is pretty fucking silly. Um, we're gonna have to be careful of that sentry. He's gonna control mid relatively well, as sentries tend to do. Um, but I'm not too scared. Especially if he uh, doesn't have his black hole sun up. So, I, the one I have to be careful of is Leon. Because uh, Leon is always, always an asshole. Um, as far as upgrading smiles, I like to increase the range and the duration of his uh, hook trap. And then the third thing is uh, kind of a mix-up, you know. Decreasing damage done by enemy awesome knots is probably a good idea, just in case you snatch up somebody like Leon, who uh, can do massive, massive damage if you let him get in your face. Or if you pull him in your face. Um, <clears throat> for the tail whip, I like increasing the uh, stun. I, I like to uh, decrease the cooldown, increase the damage. Pretty straightforward one there. Um, and then his, his flamethrower... Um, it's, it's also a pretty uh, pretty diverse one, um, if you want my honest opinion. You can go for any three combination, and it's going to turn out relatively well. Personally, I like to increase the range. Oh god, fuck. This Leon Serpent hurt me. <clears throat> okay, see you later. <laughs> I just barely made it out of there. Good jab. Good jab. Um, adding a DOT to the flamethrower is a really nice one. And then uh, I like to make it burn the scenery as well. Oh, look at that. Oh, we should have been able to kill him just then, but that's okay. Everybody on their team is at relatively low health. Unfortunately, I missed the uh, sentry just then. But, oh well. Hindsight's 2020. He tried to snatch me up in his trap, but I heard that little whirr coming. And I jumped out of the way. That's how we do. Um, the boots for... Smiles are really interesting. They basically increase your health regeneration when you're in a hiding place, such as down below there. Um, so I think that he's meant to be more of an ambush character. Pull enemies in and, um, ooh, nice kill right there. <clears throat> Pull enemies in with uh, the hook trap, and then your whole team basically uh, blitzes them and wrecks their shit. There, I was able to pull the Leon out just far enough for the Raylan to get another kill. So very, very nice. Um, this fellow Smiles is keeping me a little nervous just because uh, I think he's going to try and hook me into the turret at some point. But at least the Leon is dead. We don't have to worry about that guy no more. Uh, at least until he respawns, which I guess he should be respawned by now. <laughs> so we'll just be careful. How about that? That's going to be a good idea. And, uh, there he is. Hello, mister! I tried to snatch him up in my trap, but that seems to, uh, not work so well. He's being really dodgy, and, uh, Raylan's Rift was able to slow the Leon down just enough to, uh, avoid that Black Hole Sun from Sentry. And you can see that tail doing massive, massive damage. I really do like Smiles. Um, I don't think people know quite how to play him yet, or... Actually, he's pretty straightforward in how to play, but people definitely don't know how to counter him quite yet. So, um, I snatched that sentry up. That Black Hole Sun is going to do a lot of damage. Yeah, I just basically killed our Raylan because I Teo slapped the sentry with Black Hole Sun up. So that's not good. I've got three people on me now. I basically waited until the, the trap was almost done and smacked that sentry away, which I think is, uh... A pretty good way to do things, especially if you can get on the other side and smack them into your turret or something like that, which uh, I believe was something that I theorized out in the beta. So <clears throat> let's see what this this fucking Leon's gonna do. Not much, not much. That Raylan probably could have got the kill just then, but that's okay. And again, I fucking charged up that uh, Sentry's black hole sun. I gotta be more careful. Here's a kill. Bam! Eat him up! Eat him up! Alright, so that 
that Leon took a snipe to the face. That's gonna be pretty hurty. And, uh, oh, oh shit. Yeah. Obviously, uh, we need to be careful about having low health droids near the turret because, uh, he was able to snatch me up, no problem. That enemy smiles and, uh, my smiles, you know, it's, it's pretty straightforward on how to play it. Drag your enemy into your team slash turret, uh, smack them with the tail when the, uh, well, if you want some burst damage, just go ahead and do it any time. But I like to do it once the, uh, the hook is done. Boom. There you go. Good amount of burst damage. Just, just right there. And, uh, you know, Smiles has a good amount of health too, so you don't need to, uh, worry too much about shoving him into combat and things like that. There we go. No problem. Kinda chew up my bottom turret here, but that's okay. Um, I thought about trying to snatch up that sentry with the trap. But I saved it. I saved it! Oh my god, I'm really hoping the sentry doesn't teleport. It seems he's in combat, so he can't teleport for at least three seconds um, after he's given or taken a hit. So that's working out relatively well. I missed my trap again, and he missed his trap, so... Not too bad. We're gonna push right up on this turret, try to see if we can't get it down. Uh, guess not in that push. They're doing relatively good with uh, keeping keeping our droids off of their turrets, which is the whole goal. It's not really a game about getting kills, it's a game about um, protecting your, your shit. Protect your shit! And I'm kind of waiting for that sentry to teleport so I could snatch him up again. There's somebody. <laughs> Grabbed him up and uh, gave him a tail whip, was able to kill the, the opposing smiles with relative ease. Now we're pushing their top turret through, so I'm gonna go help out with that. Hello everyone, Smiles is here! Done. Done and done. And uh, yeah, the only one left lurking for them is a Leon. But that's gonna be fine! We could deal with a Leon. He ain't so scary when he's by himself. Actually he is. He's a great fucking assassin. Um, I'm getting out of there. I do apologize to Raylin. I think she's being just a little bit too hungry. When you see the enemies respawn and they're at full health and you're not quite at full health, then uh, the best course of action is probably to get the fuck out. <laughs> if you want me to be quite honest, I almost tail smacked that Coco, um, which is good. I didn't want to waste that. It was uh, an easy kill for, for me with the sentry once more. Yeah, dragging him close and just mobbing him with the flamethrower, it's really, really nice. Uh, Great synergy between the skills, as I pointed out in the in the beta. He's definitely not as strong as I thought he would be. You know, we got like 20 kills or some fucking crazy thing in uh in the beta, but now he's uh yeah he's relatively easy to uh, be dealt with. Although I don't know if people know how to deal with him quite yet. I definitely don't. Uh, if you get smacked up or snatched up in the in the claw trap, the best thing to do is kind of uh stick your head between your legs. Kiss your ass goodbye. <laughs> Hope that he's not in too great of a place to get you. Oh my god, let's get this. Get some of that. Get some of this. Alright. We did pretty good. Fed Rayland a kill there with my uh, my little TP snatch thing. I'm gonna go ahead and go back. Spend some more solar, upgrade my flames and things like that. First thing I usually go for is the range of the hook and duration of the hook. And uh, now I've got some range on my fire, so we should be able to uh, deal with people more effectively even when they are uh, caught in a hook. So, I really like Smiles. I don't think he's uh, the best character that I've ever seen, but he does his job relatively well. And uh, my team is supporting pretty good as well uh, at the moment too. So we need to watch out for that Black Hole Sun. Oh my god, that is ugly. I knew that was going to happen. That Raylan snipe charged it up really well. And I snatched the Leon even though uh, he was in stealth. I was aiming for the smiles and I ended up getting Leon. Which is pretty fucking hilarious. Didn't see that coming, did you boy? And uh, I kind of saved him there, but that's fine. Finish up this fucking turret. I'm not too concerned with, uh, with getting kills and things like that. Boom! Yes! Fire! Able to, to do some nasty things. There we go. A little more on the Leon. I'm kind of scared to go in there all by my lonesome. Uh, I guess Raylan's in here. I think it's going to be fine. I'll go home. 
that's what I'm gonna do. A little more purchases, and uh, we should be able to finish up the base relatively easy. They hardly touched our turrets at all. Um, I think that's mostly because our team was playing extremely well together, and um, their sentry was running around at low health uh, for a lot of the match, which meant easy kills. Easy kills! 4-0, oh, I'll take it. So, friends, this has been Smiles. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I hope that you will like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. Uh, we will revisit this character again quite soon. Look at that, 5-0. Oh. oh, what, what? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I do like him. Uh, he's not as OP as I expected him to be, but that is definitely a good thing, so nice job balancing from Ronimo. Anyways, friends, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. And until then... One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye. See you again. Goodbye, goodbye. See you, my friends.